Shalom Aleichem, this is Brother Kobe. A few months back, a uh, man from Germany reached out to me by email. He told me his name. His name is Edward Tropia. And he told me he's an author, and he's written a book. And he proceeded to tell me that one of my dreams he found online is in his book, along with other people's dreams. And I was tickled because I've never seen this coming. The Lord has given me a dream. I just put it online and now it's in a book. <laughs> Along with others. And um, he wanted to send me a free copy of his book. And I was like, guys, I like books, man. And I, I was like, okay, if you're willing to do this, could you at least autograph the book? And he sure did. He's actually sent me two copies of the book, one for me and one for my friend. And he asked me, for me to go through, review his book, and give him an honest opinion on it, you know? Okay. This is his book, The Final Revelation. It has all kind of cool pictures he made himself using ChatGPT, I believe he told me, something to do with the computer, some type of software. I don't even understand it. And it looks so real. And I'll show you in a minute. He also gives thanks to uh, Crystal Crumb on our YouTube channel, so he acknowledges her. Back to these pictures here. And this book's on end time dreams, guys. This is Second Coming. This is the Rapture, the Antichrist. This is about demons, hell. It, it got it all. And these pictures look so amazing he spent a lot of time in this okay this one's kind of cool looking can you see that wow i mean he made that uh, impressive all kinds of stuff there's there's even some of a uh, a demon one about uh Hell and I mean, it's just amazing. Look at this one. Look at that. It looks like a, uh, something you'd see on a science fiction movie. And of course, he's got my dream right there about the police officer dream the Lord's given me. He's uh, autographed it, like I said. <laughs> he even put for Brother Colby. He told me which page my dream's on. That's where he autographed it. It's just a maze. So I went through it. He had it in two parts. He told me he uh, did another revision in it. He cut out the second part, so I made it cheaper. Uh, guys, I like it. I, I like it. I like the pictures. I like the dreams. And the same time when I got this book in, the mail, I've gotten my other book in. The Pilgrim Progress by John Bunyan. This is the updated uh, edition. So I was looking at this one. Now, the Lord gave John Bunyan, while he was in jail, a vision or a dream, and he's written it down. And this is the Pilgrim's Progress. is on his dream. And in this version, they added the scriptures back to it. So I guess it used to be in it, and they took it out, but he had the scriptures back to it. So when you read this book here, you can compare the scriptures to the dream. And I was telling uh, Mr. Edward Tropia that, I says, why not add the scriptures in your book so people can see the scriptures and the dream and compare and they'll learn the scriptures? And some of y'all may be thinking, Colby, what, why buy a book of dreams that's on YouTube? Because there's going to come a time where you're not going to be able to access YouTube. It's going to be down. And I like to have books in hand. 
lot of people don't have a, a, a long attention span. I mean, I've been in church service five hours, didn't bother me. I listen to sermons that are an hour and a half or so. But some people can't handle that. And you know what else I like about this book? I, I feel it's kind of like a, a left behind book. I, I really do. It's it like a, a manual in a way. Because after the rapture or during the tribulation, they can go through, boom. Oh, that's what that dream means. There's the scriptures. I think it's a good thing, guys. So he's going to do that latest revision. Give him some time on that one. Or you can buy this one now. He already has this uh, this book translated in 30 different languages that he translated himself. And he's still working on more. This man is an author. This is how he makes his money. So he did team up with a Bible guy to put the scriptures in it. Okay. I'll leave the link below, an Amazon link, if you're interested in the book. I like having it on hand. I got some lost loved ones. It may help them, guys, for the times coming ahead. I recommend it, okay? I do love you. Go in peace. And by all means, you know what? I'll leave this link below, too, for this one. This, this is a must, guys, okay? Shalom.